Perfect. There he is. Oh, that's a nice one. What is up everybody, Fish Hawk here. Hope you guys are having a great day. If you're new here, consider subscribing. I put out new videos every single week. In this video, I'm doing some creek fishing for trout. It is a gorgeous day, about 74 degrees, sunny, no clouds in the sky, water is low and clear. Hopefully I can catch some. Stay tuned. There's one. First fish of the day, if I can get him in. Just a little fella. Gotta start somewhere. Gotta start somewhere, boys. Fish number one, guys. Not a big one, but it's a start. Today I'm using my six foot light fish hawk rod. Shimano Stratic 1000 reel. Six pound test P line fluorocarbon. Down here on this end, I'm starting out with a silver blade fish hawk spinner. And about 12 inches above that, I have a barrel swivel to keep line twist out of my line. There's one. Come here, buddy. In the net. Fish number two, another beautiful brown trout. All right, fish number two is on the board. Let's see if we can get another one. There's one. Come on, buddy, get in the net, yes! Fish number three, and biggest of the day. Beautiful fish. Doing pretty well right now. Three fish on the board. I forgot to mention this earlier, but these fish hawk rods will be for sale in a few weeks, so stay tuned for that. All right, guys, we just caught a beautiful brook trout. Looks like a stocked one. Very pretty though. Haven't caught many of these lately. Well guys, I just caught a brook trout. I did not get to catch on video. I forgot to hit record on this GoPro right here, but I did get the release, so at least you get to see it. I've been fishing with the fish hawk spinner for about 15, 20 minutes. I'm gonna switch it up to something different, see if I can catch any more fish out of here. I switched to this little brown trout crankbait. I did pretty well with this last time I was here, so hopefully I can catch some. I'm having a hard time getting this crankbait to dive deep enough in this strong current. There's a very strong current coming down through here and uh, that makes it very difficult to fish little stuff like this because the current just wants to wash it away and those fish are tucked deep right in that current. So I'm gonna have to find something a little heavier. It goes a little deeper. See if I can reach some more fish. I decided to switch to a little Rebel Crawfish crankbait. It has a pretty big bill on it. So hopefully it can get down deep enough where those fish are. There's a fish, oh. Popped off. There's a fish. Come on, come on, come on. Brookie, there we go. Look at that guys. Freaking smoked the crawfish crankbait. Let's go. 
All right, I think I got this brookie on video. Another nice brook trout on the crawfish crankbait. All right, guys, got a brookie catch on video for you. Came on this Rebel Crawfish crankbait, probably cast number five or six. This is a great lure for fishing deeper water. It's got that big bill on it, gets down deep pretty quick. So maybe I can pull some more out of here. Oh, little trout hit it right, right when I was about to pull it out of the water. They're liking this crankbait. I'm pretty sure there's some crawfish in this creek, so I'm sure these fish are eating some crawfish. This crawfish is ticking right along the bottom. You can see I'm getting down deep because it's hitting the bottom. You'll see my rod tip just going like this. It's that crankbait digging into the rocks. That's what you want, just barely nipping the bottom. There's one. Oh, another brookie. He hit it right when I was about to pull it out of the water. Another brookie on the crawfish crankbait. This is just a little guy. One great thing about this crawfish crankbait is that it floats. So if you're digging it down deep into the rocks and it gets hung up, just let off, give it a little slack, and a lot of times it'll float to the top. No more fish on the crawfish crankbait. I'm gonna try something else. I'm gonna try out this little Berkeley Atomic Teaser. There's one. Oh no. Oh, getting bites. Ah, uh, come on. There's one. Let's go. Yes. I knew I was getting bites. Another brookie on the atomic teaser. I wasn't really sure if this was gonna work or not, but it did, so I'm gonna to toss it around a little longer. There's one. What the heck? Ah, oh, gotcha, buddy. Another brook trout falls victim to the atomic teaser. He hit it right at my feet. Pretty decent size one.
Those trout are really liking this Atomic Teaser. Unfortunately, it's the only one I have in my bag, so I'm gonna have to go stock up. There's one. Fish on, baby. Another brookie. Found where they're hiding. Oh yeah, right in the net. Nice and easy, buddy. Another pretty brookie, guys. I think I figured these brookies out. There's some fast white water over here on the left and there's some fast white water over here on the right. But right here down the center, it's slow. It's, there's no white water right here down the center. So what I'm doing is I'm casting all the way up to the base of the falls and I'm just letting this uh, atomic teaser kind of sink down and I'm just kind of jigging it, popping my rod tip and just working it, trying to keep it deep and right here in the center. And that's where those fish are hanging out. There he is. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh my gosh. This is a freaking monster, guys. Holy crap, what a brown trout. Oh, let's go. Let's freaking go. Holy shit. Look at that atomic teaser right in the upper lip. Popped right out too, guys. Holy crap, look at the size of this brown trout, guys. What an absolute beauty. Holy smokes, guys. This spot is absolutely loaded with trout. I don't know how many I've caught. I've lost count, but that big brown right there was just the icing on the cake. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm going to keep it going. Well, guys, I don't know if I'm going to be able to top that last one. Fish on. Wow. Let's go. Let's go. Heck yes. Let's go. Look at that absolute gorgeous smallmouth bass. That's awesome, guys. Never expected to catch a smallmouth bass out of here. Little smallie, guys. Gorgeous fish. See you, buddy. All right, guys, that is going to do it for today. Had an amazing day of trout fishing out here on the creek. Caught some brookies, caught some brownies, caught one really nice brown trout, and I caught them all on a variety of lures. Uh, fish hawk spinner, rebel crawfish crankbait, atomic teaser. It was a lot of fun, beautiful day, can't beat it. All the information for the gear I used to be down in the description if you want to check it out. If you're new to the channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up. It'll really help me out. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. Fish hawk out.